for the work we need the stabilized donor blood, watch glass, the capillary on 0.02 milliliters, the graph chamber, cover glass, stora or pasta pipette. 5% solution of acetic acid, rubber tube, spray bulb, alcohol, cotton wool, test tubes, medicine droppers, and microscope. The counting chamber is a thin glass plate with four troughs in the middle. There are three narrow stripes between them. The middle stripe is 0.1 mm lower than the others and divided with the trough. From the two sides of this trough there are the meshworks of Garayev. At first clean the chamber and the covering glass with the cotton wool moistened with the alcohol. Dry them. Put the covering glass on the center of the chamber. With the help of thumbs move the covering glass back and forth to the appearance of the colorful rings of Newton. Leave the prepared chamber on the table. Put 0.4 ml of 5% solution of acetic acid into the test tube with the help of the pipette and put the solution on the bottom of the test tube. Take the capillary with the mark 0.02 ml from the plate. Connect it with the rubber tube and fix the spray bulb with the tube. Then take the watch glass and prepare a piece of cotton wool. Put a drop of blood on the glass. Clean the tip of the capillary with the help of cotton wool. Put the used cotton wool on the plate. Add 0.02 ml of blood on the bottom of the test tube with acetic acid so that the upper layer of solution is remained unpainted. Raise the capillary slowly. Clean it with the acetic acid solution, then dry it. Put the capillary on the plate. Then slowly waving the test tube, mix its stuff. Take the obtained solution into the pasta pipette. Bring the tip of the pasta pipet or stora on the body of the covering glass and the chamber. Put a small drop of the solution on the middle stripe of Gorev chamber. It will run under the covering glass under the influence of the force of capillarity. The excess of solution is removed with the help of cotton wool. Take the microscope. Light the filter view. Put the condenser absolutely down. Put the central part of the chamber exactly under the objective lens. Pay your attention, the mesh work should be under the objective lens. You should put the objective lens down till 0.5 cm distance approximately 
controlling it from the side of microscope. Then put it uh, up till you can see uh, the le uh, leukocytes clearly. Count the leukocytes under the small increase. For counting, use the rule of Yegorov. Only the cells lying inside the square and on the left and upper borders belong to this square. All the other cells not. The number of leukocytes in one liter of the blood is calculated by the next formula. Our result matches the norm.